Nice. Hello, crazy people, and welcome to the 1,000 question... Wait, fuck. Hello, crazy people, and welcome to the 1,000 subscriber question and answer special. I am Lolly Dragon, and I am here to answer the questions you have left me. So, let's get right into it. First question is from Dank Penguin Wizard. They ask, to lewd the dragon lolly or not to lewd the dragon lolly? That is the question. The answer is you never lewd the dragon lolly. What are you, crazy man? Are you trying to die? <laughs> the next question is from Bobby Bass. He asks, if Ginny has three balloons and Billy has one, how many doctors will it take to sew Timmy's arm back on? Well, the answer to that's simple. If you carry the one, add a three, and multiply by the s circumference of, well, like, I don't know, I think it's Billy's butt? I, I can't really remember. You get, like, fourteen and a half. So, really, the question should be, why are you trying to sew Timmy's arm back on? He doesn't deserve to have it back. He's an asshole. Next question is from Noble Wizard, and he asked, this question is on here a lot, will there be more cooking with Lolly? The answer is, well, you know, if I think of anything funny, I might. I don't know, I'm not a very clever person. That's why I'm doing a question and answer for a thousand subscriber video. Next question comes from Colin, uh, C-O-L-L-I-N, I can English, Cole Burson. I hope I pronounce the second name correctly. They asked three questions. First is face reveal. Um, that question's on here a couple times. If I have a reason to, but I'm not gonna just be like, hey look, here's my face, how I... Um, second question is, favorite gun in my collection? That would have to be my Union Switch and Signal 1911. For those of you who don't know what it is, uh, during World War II, about four manufacturers made 1911s, that is Colt, Remington, Rand, Ithaca, uh, Union, Switch, and Signal, actually it's five, and Sanger. Sanger made 500. Good luck finding them. They went, I think the last one in auction went for like $35,000. Union, Switch, and Signal made the second least of them, and that's why I'm proud to own one. They made about 55000 And And the last question is, dream bucket list to buy guns, or dreams slash bucket list slash to buy guns uh the only one that comes to mind is i would really like a nice um a nice svt 40 really that's the only thing that comes to my mind really maybe a smg reproduction fg 42 type 1 when they start making them uh or, you know, actually I'm thinking of a lot of things now. The reproduction STG-44s that are supposed to be coming out soon, or they might already be coming out. I haven't really looked into it recently. That one's actually more doable. I'm getting sidetracked. Uh, next one is from Windy Dreams. Wind yes, that's correct. I, I can English sometimes. I'd like to know the story behind your username. How did you get the name Lolly Dragon? Well, I will answer that right here for you folks. Um, gosh, I sound terrible. Uh, the answer is a long time ago, and I mean early 2014. I was getting a little bit bored about the username that I had for like 10 years before that. Uh, not 10. I wasn't that young when I started online gaming. It was probably like 7 or 5 years before that, whatever. Really. I really like that name. I wish I had it still. Well, my friend's like, well, if you're bored of the name, why not change it to Lolly Dragon? I bet you won't. And I said, you're on. And that's my name is Lolly Dragon. Good story, huh? The next question comes from Evan McLaughlin. McLaughlin. And he says, hi, Lolly. Will you upload more if I find something I really want to do for an upload. I'm get to more of that later. I know there's another question in here about it. Uh, Chris Peterson asks, I'm going to ask so, or he says, I'm going to ask so many questions. His first question being, how many more subscribers until we force you to make more content in what's your favorite anime? Those two questions are one. Uh, let me ask, answer the first one. This is actually an answer to Evan's question as well. Um, 
I just don't really... I, I, it's like if I find something I want to do, I'll upload it, but I'm not going to like start doing stuff I really don't want to do. That's just how it is. Uh, the other question is, what is your favorite anime? If I had to pick one, probably Code Geass, because it's pretty much... It's like... So, the anime, only anime I watched before that was Bleach. It's like the roots. It's what got me started. Code Geass is like the trunk that sprouted out into everything. Of me loving everything. So, Code Geass will have to be the answer to that one. And they also say, one more anime-related question. After watching your setup tour, did you see Girls Unpanzered their film? I have not. And they have another question, which that means that the last question was a lie, where it says one more. It says, and lastly, how many cats do you have? Because I have seen quite a few of them in all of your videos. All I can say is, ah! 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 Next question is from James DeClerc who ask, do you have another hobby other than gaming? Or well, aside from gaming, as he says. Uh, I have a lot of hobbies. I build Legos, I watch anime, I collect figures, I build model kits, I collect guns, I collect World War II. Memorabilia is probably a terrible word to use for that, but I'm going to. I collect books and read them. Uh, I think that's about it. Yeah, I think about it. Um, next question is from Cart of Cart of Olsholos. I butchered the hell out of that. I know. What do you do for work? I don't. I don't work. At least not yet. We'll probably get to that in another question. I remember another one in here. Ricegum forty two o sixty nine asks. Lolly, who is the second most special person in TBLF? Oh man. I think they're all. I think everyone below me, obviously, because I'm the most special. That's why you're asking that question. I know it. I know it is, Ricegum. I know that's why you're asking. Uh, I think everyone else is about on equal footing. Maybe coffee. Coffee's pretty special. Bluefire asked, What types of cats do you have? Um, the cat kind, you know, I think the ones that ride on four, a couple of them I've, a couple of them don't have four, they only have like three, but usually four, four legs, a head, some cat ears, whiskers, a lot of fur, a couple of them no fur, or very short fur, uh, but the cat kind, you know, they just look different, they're like different colors, you know, but they're all the same on the inside, they're cats like people and this has been life lessons with lolly next question comes from matthew hughes and he yes that's correct matthew hughes and he says can you answer this question by screaming in pure war thunder fear what is your favorite game to play well not my favorite game of all time but my favorite game to actually play and to unwind with is probably isle 2 sturmovic right now uh, just, if I'm, like, in a bad mood, or I'm just bored, I hop on there, and I never have a bad time, I just have fun. It's always fun to fly around planes, in a not really that competitive manner, because I suck at it. So, I've never worried about doing good. Next question is, Jack Shadow, he says, Hey Lolly, my question is, why don't you make War Thunder videos and make some money, considering you already play with Bo on a regular basis? This stems back to the other questions why I don't make videos. This one will have an extended answer of why I don't make War Thunder videos and consider making money. I don't make War Thunder videos because, well, I don't make them anymore. Because I don't genuinely have fun making War Thunder videos for myself. Um, sometimes I don't have very much fun making War Thunder videos with Bo, but most of the time I have fun. Most of the time, it's fun. It's just, there's really bad vehicles in War Thunder that are just a drag. Uh, and consider and consider making money on them. I would never be able to make money on them. I swear like a fucking sailor. And the way YouTube runs now, I would never be able to monetize anything. So, 
really that's your answer that's also kind of the answer why I don't consider making a bunch of other videos because like it's with if I start making money I see it more as a job and something I have to do rather than something I want to do and I prefer making YouTube videos to be something I want to do not that I feel I have to the next question comes from Nameless Doll 666 and they ask, will we ever get a TVL face reveal? Like, it would be a pretty cool to put a face to the names and personalities that make up TVL. Oh, and your cat is adorable. Thank you for the adorable cat compliment. Uh, I can't speak for everyone else in TVL. Mine is like, if I have a reason to, I will. But like, once again, don't really have a reason to. So nothing's gonna come up yet. The next questions comes from one. Kobe Wobi. What a weird name, Kobe Wobi. His first question is, why is the sky blue? Because you touch yourself at night. His next question is, what is at the bottom of the ocean? My hopes and dreams. His next question is, what if a woodchuck, or sorry, if a woodchuck could chuck wood, exactly how much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? The answer is obviously 14. I love the number 14, apparently. What is your favorite color? It use, it's blue, but I'm starting to lean more towards the color pink. I don't know why. It's just a very relaxing color. Do you like pizza? Is his final question. And that depends on where it is made. Unpopular opinion, I like Pizza Hut pizza almost the most. Most people I talk to do not. I don't know. Do you guys like Pizza Hut pizza? Let me know. Uh, next question is from Senator Buffalo, and he asks, Do you do Twitch? And the answer is no. I might do Twitch in the future because, uh, stemming back to the YouTube thing, YouTube videos are more fun to make when I want to make them. Twitch would be fun, like, if I want to, if, like, I just want to chill and play games and maybe get donations for it. Really, it doesn't matter to me about the donations. But like chill and play games and talk with people but we'll have to see my internet kind of sucks and my rig kind of doesn't work well for something like that uh it's like a late like 2015 build for a thousand bucks so it's not really the best rig in the world but it gets the job done so maybe in the future i will but for right now no edmunds demands demand demands demands Ask, how high were you when you made this video? I don't smoke the devil's lettuce. This is a Christian household, damn it. Next question is from Mr. Magnet007, or 007. He's getting James Bond on me. I gotta watch him. He asks, Lolly, what keyboard is that and what headset do you use? The keyboard is a Razer Black Widow Chroma. I spent way too much money on this stupid keyboard. Uh, the headset I use is actually a Samsung, a Samsung, uh, Galaxy's headphones that came with my phone. Because my other headset broke. Falling on the floor is not very good for headsets. They, they don't like it. So don't, don't let your headsets fall on the floor. Uh, if you want to know what my microphone is, because it's not part of my headset, it is a, uh, Blue Yeti. No, not. Damn it! It's a Blue Snowball. So yeah, that answers your question. Uh, Sir Booms a lot asks, "Is our pet squirrel still alive?" Uh, and also asks, "Is he the reason Tivolos mascot is the squirrel?" I hope he's still alive. I had to let him go back into the wilderness. I did let him go in an area where he's highly unlikely to get hit by a car, but at the same time, a natural predator is more likely to get him. So hopefully, he's still alive. I don't know. And no, he's not the reason for the squirrel's mascot. The squirrel was the TBLF mascot way before he ever showed up into my life. Sir Boom's Lot also asked another question. He says, how did you get the name Lolly? Which was answered earlier. So please refer to that answer. John Brony asked, how many dragons can you loot in one afternoon? You don't loot dragons. That's not healthy for you, you know. Like, I think that's how you get, like, eviscerated by a dragon. 
I, I wouldn't recommend trying something like that. So yeah. Next question is from Busted Busterful, and he has a lot of questions. First question is, what's your favorite anime, or anime or animes? Um, since I said Code Geass was my favorite, I will add more to that. I like most Gundam animes. I, I could say the ones I don't like are probably Seed and uh, maybe like the Build Fighter series. Haven't watched the haven't watched the Build Fighter series, so I can't really say the answer no. But I don't really like Seed. Um, Kobayashi's Dragon Maid is nice. I'm loving Girls Last Tour. Uh, Re Zero was fantastic. Angel Beats will always be something I will enjoy watching. I loved Black Bullet, and sad that it hasn't gotten a second season yet. Uh, anything else off the top of my head? Uh, Ghost in the Shell is pretty nice. I, I got to watch Ghost in, the Shell Ghost in the Shell recently, and I enjoyed it a lot. The standalone complex and Arise. I, I watched those. They were good. That's about all I can think of for that question right now. Uh, if there's anything else, you'll probably see a flash on the screen. Do you have a waifu? Hmm. That's the second question. That's a tough one to answer. If, like, you... If I would consider... The fact that I have a waifu, I'd probably consider that there's two characters I really like, and that would be Furutaka from Kantai Collection and Altira from the Fate series. Probably Altira more than uh, Furutaka at this point, but you know, I don't think I consider waifus a thing I do. Uh, what games do you like? I like games of most genres, it really just depends on the game. Uh, I used to be nothing but FPS, but since I moved to the computer, I've been playing more RPGs and some strategy games and simulators. Uh, those are probably about the gist of it right there. Uh, as far as specifics, there's like near Isle 2, as said earlier. I play a lot of War Thunder, obviously. Um, Neptune games are fun to play. Uh... I've been playing Phoenix Stilla and loving it. Can't think of anything else off the top of my head. So, that's about it. Uh, will you make more videos if I have more good ideas that I want to do? What are favorite movies and TV shows? I don't watch TV. So, there's actually no TV, like, there's TVs in my house, but there's no satellite or cable hooked up to them. So I don't watch TV. Uh, favorite movies? Uh, I love Saving Private Ryan, but can't say it's my favorite. I love Star Wars. I love all the Star Wars movies, including the new one. I haven't seen... Actually, I shouldn't say that. Uh, but other than those, those things, I can't really think of anything off the top of my head. I actually don't watch a lot of movies. I get made... Or not made fun of. I get told I don't watch enough movies by people in TBLF. Next question is, any fears? Oh, plenty. I am horribly social phobic. Uh, that's why I don't have a job, actually. Uh, the fear of being away from my house terrifies me so much for some reason. But other than that, there's not really much, not not really much else I can think of. No like practical fears. Uh, Coke or Pepsi, Dr Pepper. Uh, can we be friends? It de depends on your definition of friends. Would we be able to play games with you? I joined Bo from pretty much all of his community events, so I play games there. I'm not really a sociable person, so I honestly, I'm not very comfortable talking with new people, and that's why I don't talk, play games with a lot of people. Uh, so sorry about that. And, uh, sorry, will I be in the video? You are right now. And his last question is, am I asking too many questions? And the answer is, there is never such thing as asking too many questions. Iramaz Zamari, I hope I didn't mess that one up too much, asks, or says, beautiful kitten, name of kitten, or kitty, not kitten. Uh, her name is Riot. And, yeah, her name is Riot. De Deadless Walnut ask what games do you enjoy the most uh, I think I covered that pretty well in Busted's question but yeah about like near 
Fate, um, Neptune Games, IL-2, that's the gist of it. Cannon Fodder asked, do you own the cat or does the cat own you? If you ask that question, you've obviously never had a cat in your household because the cat owns you. Nick Mettler asked, M1 Grand or M1 Carbine? The M1 Carbine is an amazingly fun gun to shoot, but it, in my heart, will never beat an M1 Grand. Pedro Santos asked, hey, or says, Hey Lolly, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. I'm actually doing pretty good today. Ma Boger asks, What's your favorite anime? Once again, Baliko Gios. When Drea asks, what if your cat was purple? I assume that's what he's asking. Uh, I would probably be pretty internet famous by now if I had a purple cat, to be honest. I think that'd be a fucking amazing thing. I, people would want to watch that all the damn time. Next question is from Mike Powers, and he asks, When will Bo do a face reveal? When he is good and ready. Kevin Agnew asks, What kind of cat is that? Uh, it's a Bengal. She's actually a Bengal. It's a mixture of two different types of cats. I think an Asian leopard cat and a house cat, something like that. I can't remember. Oh yeah, she's Bengal. Sebastian Nelson asks, what was that shirt you have on? Looks cool. Uh, it's from a YouTuber named Purple Eyes Woodafu. And it's one of his shirts. I'll leave a link to his channel if you don't know who I'm talking about. And a link to the shirt as well so you can see it. But yeah, he's a really fu funny guy. Pedro Reed says, came here for Lolly and got cat video when, what is thy cat's name? Thy cat's name, once again, is Riot. Noble Reflex asks, do you watch Critical Role? What is your favorite movie, favorite game, and favorite meal? Uh, I think the movie and games have been established. I don't watch Critical Role. And my favorite meal uh, is either homemade burrito bowls tater tot casserole or mashed potatoes and bread i'm a very indecisive person but they're all good also i probably eat way too much starch the last question comes from dark war dragon and he asks what is your favorite tank and plane in war thunder and why my favorite plane hmm is a tough one. The, the two that I think of is the P-43 because it's a it's a cool plane, a cool piece of history, and it's just a lot of fun to fly. Uh, and the J-7W-1 because the J-7W-1 has to be my favorite aircraft of all time by its design alone, but I really don't like flying it in the game because of how high tier it is. I just don't like playing high tiers. Uh, and tank? Ooh, that's a tough one. I don't know. Might be the Ram 2. Enjoy the Ram 2 a lot. <clears throat> and the last thing that is not a question comes from James Yadig. And he s says, I don't question awesomeness. Keep being the amazing lolly dragon. My response to that is, always question awesomeness because that's how you know it's awesome. So, I hope you guys enjoy this. Thank you for listening and, you know, thank you for subscribing. I hope to see you guys in the next video that I do, whenever that is. And keep being awesome. Thanks. Peace out.